Hi, in this video we will learn how to extract point data from a curve. Open the webplot digitizer online website. Click on the launch. File, load image, load the image. I have the stress strain curve. Align the axis. Proceed. X1 x2 again y1 y2 this is the non-linear stress strain true stress strain curve of alumina 6061 click on complete one pop-up xy x and y axis calibration this is x0 x0.18 y0 y 400 click on ok now from here the yield stress of aluminum 6061 is 276 we will extract the point data from 276 you will see the x and y coordinates here 276 Here in the first point I have not selected properly. To delete that point, delete point D. Click this point. That's it. Add point A means add point here. Now view data. This is the x and y coordinates. Download dot csv file. Show all. Yeah. This is the stress column. First is the stress column. And the second is the strain column. And to convert this stress strain data, true stress strain data, to use in the nonlinear pretension analysis, we need to do one more step. This is the plastic strain. Copy this stress column, paste here, equal to. dollar symbol minus the reason I am oh sorry The reason I am uh, subtracting this data from the first strain point is the first strain. This is a strain, right? When you open the graph, yeah, this is the plastic strain. So, to consider the only this two stress strain data, we have to remove the elastic strain from here. That's why I am subtracting this point. Oh, something missed up. We have to add dollar symbol here. this point copy this data this is the perfect true stress strain data which can be used in the non-linear static analysis
and one more thing you need to remember this the FA analysis will accept dot csv format actually this excel file is in x dot xlsx file we need to convert to dot csv file aluminium 6061 yes see this properties dot csv format 